gonna try and get this video done in like one recording. We'll see how that works. I've never gotten a video done in one recording. I'm sure if you guys have the Corsair Vengeance RGB RAM sticks that you know that when you put your PC to sleep for some reason they still stay on. Well in today's video I'm gonna show you guys how to fix that. What's up everyone my name is Daniel and welcome to Hardware Bytes. On this channel we do tech reviews, tutorials, and we build PCs. Just trying to expand my horizons, you know? As I already said before in today's video we are going to be fixing the problem in regards to the RAM. I have a three camera setup going on here so I have my screen being recorded, I have my phone also recording my my PC so you guys can actually see in real time kind of I guess what is gonna happen while you're doing it and then I have my camera as well because you know obviously why wouldn't you want to see this beautiful face I mean the beard is looking pretty nice if I do say so myself right, enough enough blabbering on let's let's actually get into what you guys clicked on this video for so the first step in the process is to make sure that you actually have Corsair IQ software downloaded if you don't have that downloaded make sure you go ahead and download it links will be down in the description below so you guys know where to go just because that's really the only way that this is going to work okay okay we're here in corsair iq now this is what the home screen is going to look like now what we want to do first is we want to go over and, and make sure that our rgb is popping up right here for me vengeance rgb pro sl okay and you want to go ahead and hover over it might take a second click on hardware lighting so basically the difference between lighting effects and the hardware lighting tab is lighting effects is what the RGB is doing while your PC is awake hardware lighting is actually what is going on while your PC is asleep I learned this through trial and error and as you guys see on the camera over here I am on the hardware lighting tab and my RAM is completely turned off Okay, and when I go to lighting effects, my little light, the RAM turns on and my little lighting effects are going on. Now usually, you're going to go down to the lighting layer se section. Usually there's going to be a lighting layer here already. That's the reason why it stays on. So I'm just going to go ahead and add it because I already turned it off. I'm going to go static color, make it white. Okay, all right. So now you can see in the camera that there is just a static white color. It's probably hard to tell because my phone can't really capture color that well so now that you have found whatever lighting layer is on your little lighting layer section tab in hardware lighting you want to go ahead and go to the three dots on the side over here and hit delete okay once you hit delete it might take a second to, sh to show up on your PC but the lighting effect will actually disappear and you just won't have any issues anymore and just to show it and if, in case you guys are concerned that your computer won't have RGB lighting anymore all I do is click back on lighting effects tab and we have our lighting effects back so I can go ahead and close Corsair IQ now I can go ahead and just stop recording on my computer if you guys like this overall background let me know down in the comments below. One Piece is getting pretty fire, if I do say so, in my opinion. I have my little Sanji over here, bro. Then I have Yu in the background. Okay, you guys don't care. It's okay. Now we are going to go ahead and just show you what this looks like in, I guess, real time. So my camera is not hooked up to my computer, so don't worry, it won't shut off. I'm going to go ahead and put my PC to sleep now. And you just want to give it a second. So as you can see, the RAM turns off first because we shut off the hardware lighting. But once my computer actually fully goes into sleep and the monitor turns off, everything on my computer will turn off. Just give it a second. And then, there you go. Now you don't have to worry about RAM still showing up. I do have a RGB like light strip in the back of my motherboard that just always stays on. There's nothing I can do about that. It's not through Corsair or anything. A nice, simple, easy way to fix your RAM sticks from having RGB on while the PC is asleep. If you guys did enjoy this quick little tutorial today, make sure to go ahead and smash that like button and comment down below if you do have any issues. I will try my best to help you. I am not a Corsair IQ expert, but I will do everything I can and I might even do research for you, you know? 
weekend if you do want to stay up to date with the channel make sure you hit that subscribe button down below i am here to try try and help you save money and time for your setup and gaming experience thank you guys for watching and letting me entertain you with my stupidity and i will see you guys in the next video adios